Uh, okay, so that's the Cyber Monday sale. That's my talk, the blah, blah for the week. Are you guys ready to go to? Hey, what's in my pocket? What's this squishy in my pocket? Aw, oh, man. I got anybody else reach in their pants and find doggy poop bags? I told you guys, I'm, li I'm back in it with you guys. I'm totally back in it. I didn't, you guys ever walk a turtle? It's kind of weird, man. No, I'm walking the dog. I got poop bags in my pocket. <laughs> Check it out. Check it out. Watch my magic. Watch my magic. There's nothing up my sleeve. See, nothing up my sleeve. <laughs> oh yeah. Don't get any weird ideas. They don't work on humans. These don't work on humans or big dogs. You guys know how small baby is. Uh, I gotta tell you, baby is a two bag. Baby is a two bag. Is a two is a two poop poop bag kind of dog. If you go out, don't make the mistake of walking out with this. For all those guys who have small dogs. And you guys gotta walk your girlfriend's or your wife's dog. Don't be like, don't be like weird. Don't be like, oh, well, I'm only gonna need one. Don't be like cavalier and be like, oh, don't worry about it, baby. I'm only gonna need one dog. Don't be cool like that. That's a mistake you don't wanna have to make. And like, don't be stupid and try and kick it off the sidewalk. The last thing you wanna do is kick dog crap off the sidewalk and have that stuff stuck to your shoe for a while. Your, your girlfriend's gonna be like, or your wife, she's gonna be like, what did you do? Well, I told you to take another bag. Why don't you ever listen to me? And then you're gonna be like, oh God, why did we get, now we're gonna have this conversation all because of it. Take an extra bag. You don't wanna run out of poop bags when you're on the street. Were well, you gonna take off your own underwear and wrap it in the lines? Like, just weird. Everybody calm down. Everybody calm down. So did you guys learn your lesson? Always take an extra poop bag. It's okay. It's better to have too much than too little. It's your own, it's your own fault for feeding the dog those... Man, I gave baby... Last time I was here for the marathon, I brought baby these treats. There was this stuff wrapped in... It was peanut butter wrapped thing. She really liked it. Oh man, that dog got diarrhea so bad. She pooped all over. Her whole ass is hairy and like... I thought she was like, she looked, her ass was so hairy, she looked like a Greek sailor. Oh, <laughs> that's right, I said it. Her ass was so hairy, she looked like a Greek sailor. And so I was like, and she had all this crap stuck to her ass, and I'm walking the dock, and she's got all this stuff. It was gross, it was gross. People are walking me, walking back, and the, the half marathon was on, and I'm walking through the half marathon, and they're like, they're like, Hey man, what's wrong with your dog? He goes, nothing wrong with my dog. Stop bugging me. I'm gonna rub this dog all over you. And oh man, I come back in. SLC's covered in this rubber smock and these huge rubber glasses. I thought she was getting ready to like clean up a murder scene. And then we had to wash the dog twice. I really, that was, that was a real crappy experience. <laughs> I gotta say, oh man, oh, it was brutal. All right. Oh my goodness, you gave your dog too much canned whipped cream? <laughs> You're not supposed to do that. The dog loves it. <laughs> the dog loves it. The, the too much whipped cream, that's really funny. 